Hello and welcome to my weekly Geeky Week, the show in which I talk about what has been going on in my Geeky World over the past seven days. Top story today is that a new trailer has been released for Sherlock Series 3. It is just over a minute long and is pretty exciting. There is also an interactive trailer available online, which I have put a link to below. The first episode of Series 3 will air at 9pm on BBC One on New Year's Day in the UK. In Doctor Who news, many more The Time of the Doctor promo pictures have been released in the lead-up to the Christmas special, including a Punch and Judy show and some child drawings of some of the Doctor's past adventures. What does it all mean? I've put a link to them below. In other Doctor Who news, Stephen Moffat has confirmed that Series 8, the first series with Peter Capaldi at the TARDIS console, will not be split into two. I am really happy with this news. I don't like mid-season breaks. Series 8 will begin filming shortly and will probably be aired in around August-ish 2014 on BBC One. Brian Singer has announced via Twitter that X-Men Days of Future Past will have a sequel in 2016. It will be called X-Men Apocalypse and currently has a release date in the US of the 27th of May 2016. The European premiere of The Hobbit The Desolation of Smaug was held in Berlin a couple of nights ago, following the LA world premiere on December the 2nd. The second Hobbit film will be in cinemas from December the 13th. And finally, Wizards vs. Aliens series 2 ended this week with two episodes penned by Russell T Davis. The series is still available on the BBC iPlayer if you would like to see it, and fingers crossed for series 3. So in conclusion... <laughs> Sherlock is coming back soon and I'm not sure that the Sherlock fandom is coping particularly well. I mean, come on, it's only been two years. We are not ready. This has been my weekly geekery.